A uh, long time ago, I used to live in Las Vegas, and um, I had a neighbor, he was some drunk uh, former uh, military guy, uh, and one day we were talking about uh, just uh, nothing, and uh, he had told me that he used to work uh, on a, uh, at a Area 51, and so I was like, oh yeah, you know, I haven't seen the aliens, what do they look like, blah, 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 yada, yada. And he would never, ever tell me. Nothing, nothing, nothing. You couldn't pry anything out of him. But uh, one night, uh, we had a power outage. And, um, like, the whole neighborhood was black. You couldn't see anything. So the, the night sky was, like, really dark. You could see, like, a lot of the stars because there was no outside light to drown out the, uh, the stars. I mean, he was real stinking drunk. He's, I remember this guy used to drink, like, a, like a half gallon of whiskey every day three days so we're just talking and bullshitting and out of nowhere he goes he goes hey you see uh, orion's belt and i was like no i don't know what the hell it looks like and he goes yeah up there he goes you see orion's belt he goes you see how you see two stars that are straight very very parallel to each other and then there's a little star that's slightly adjacent and off to the you know left and i said yeah yeah i see it whatever and he goes the bad aliens live on that adjacent star and I looked at him, and I'm like, okay, yeah, yeah, sure, whatever. Uh, and he goes, yeah, no, he goes, I'm serious. He goes, uh, the, the two stars, that's where the good aliens live. The bad aliens live on that other star. And he said the good aliens look like the, tr the traditional grays that we see um, on, you know, on magazines, on the internet with the big head, the big eyes. They're really small and gray. He said the bad aliens are brown colored. Uh, very tall and a smell I don't know what the hell he was talking about so I'm like yeah 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 sure and then I'm like because I didn't really believe in UFOs then um, but he goes uh, he goes uh, I said if there's really aliens I said how do their UFOs like how are they able to travel from that star all the way over here because you know we're dealing with you know rocket engines and stuff like that and he said that um, he said that the UFOs, they basically run on electricity that's created out of nothing. I think he said space. He goes, they have like a, um, it was really, you know, it was, he said it in a confusing way, but he said that, that the UFOs run on electricity that's gathered up in space and that instead of how a rocket uh, is, is driven by thrust, by a combustion engine, he says uh, the reason how the UFOs are able to go so fast uh, is that um, it op like he said that there's an engine on a UFO that opens up a void in space and it's almost like he said the UFO is not that it's being thrust but it's falling into itself I don't know uh, I I'm not sure if I believed him but uh, he said it pretty matter-of-factly and he was uh, I mean super drunk because this guy you could not ever have told him anything of a kind you could never tell you know get anything out of him but then he just goes off and uh, says that so um, who knows it could be it could be real I mean um, UFOs you know I, I kind of do believe in UFOs because I kind of seen one uh, I'm not sure if it was real, but um, it was in the Mojave Desert, and um, there was a plane um, going overhead, but it was going way, way too fast to be a plane. It's almost like when you when you see a jet, and uh, you know it's going uh, you know over across the sky. It's probably doing 500 miles an hour, maybe 450. Well, this thing was going like 40 times faster than what a jet would be going up that high in the sky. So I don't know what the hell it was, and um, who knows? Is it true? Hell if I know. But. Um, if, if any government officials see this, and if this is true, and I let out uh, government secrets, uh, please don't kill me. Uh, I don't want to die. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I should just keep my mouth shut.